17's digital reporter Jody McCreary is fact checking her numbers and whether she is taking too much credit for it. The ad says when it comes to human trafficking, North Carolina is one of the worst states in the nation. But do those numbers add up? In the ad, Senate candidate Sherry Beasley says traffickers have taken advantage of our highways. Turning our state into one of the worst places in America for this horrific crime. She says North Carolina is in the top 10 for human trafficking reports. And that's true. In 2020, the National Human Trafficking Hotline ranked us ninth with 260 cases. But the states with the most cases also have the most people. And on a per capita basis, we rank 33rd. For every 100,000 people, two and a half cases. Another question, is Beasley overstating her role in getting that court up and running? I put that question to the one person who would know best, District Court Judge Tony King. She's the one who runs the court in Cumberland County. In a statement, King gave the credit to Beasley saying her commitment to keeping North Carolina safe never wavered and that she took action to raise awareness on this serious issue in our state. The process to start what's known as the Worth Court began in 2018 when Beasley was on the Supreme Court but was still months away from becoming Chief Justice. She took over for Mark Martin in 2019, the same year the Worth Court began. Uh, and I think this court has done uh, really important work to ensure that more people understand the signs of human trafficking and are aware of what a really major issue it is in the state. There's an even bigger question. Why is Beasley's campaign putting so much focus on the issue in the first place? Click on this story online to find out. For CBS 17 News, I'm Jody McCrary.